What's going on YouTube? Same shit with TKO Gaming, bringing you guys a crazy ass glitch here on the Abomination Strike. All you have to do is find three people, get together, and get into this strike, and you guys are going to be able to farm the crap out of Fogoth. I'm telling you guys, it's unreal. You guys are going to get free exotics, free skeleton keys, free of all the other beautiful stuff that you can get. Strike loot is just crazy. You can open up that chest at the end over and over again. And not only that, but your PvE KD is going to be so much higher shout out to my friend delta 12 for telling me this he found this glitch posted on reddit and he actually told me so i'm not taking credit for it all right i just want to show you guys share with you guys because this will most likely get patched that's how crazy good it is every single video we do a giveaway for this one we're doing a one-off big giveaway i found a huge deal on ebay for one gear subscription of playstation plus one year my friends all you have to do is like this video and comment down below anything you love or hate about destiny and you have to be a subscriber to the channel so that we can direct message you if you win so keep that in mind my friends thank you so much remember just like and comment on this video so in this as you saw we're in the room right before the summoning pit and instead of going into the room to fogoth we just turn around and we fly doing this all the way across now i'm doing this on the warlock guys it is the hardest class to do this glitch on because the glide is so slow the movement is so slow and i'm doing it with a sword i did it with a sword before but i'm showing you guys that with the meta multi-tool it's so easy you get on this rock just follow this video step by step you're gonna fall up on this lamp once you get on the lamp you're gonna go around the corner and you're gonna just drop on the platform once you're on the platform you're gonna jump up once again and you're just going to go two columns over and you'll see you you can actually see this crevice of a rock and you just slide on in it's that easy now you're outside the map and you just follow this it's pretty much a straight line and then going all the way up top a hill and and then you're gonna drop down into the strike it's freaking weird i don't know how the heck this happened i don't even know who the hell you gotta be to figure this kind of stuff out but shout out to you my friend you are awesome and then you come over here you'll see me drop down not make that jump and i discovered if you need to summon fogoth and in, in summoning pits weird how i said it but if you actually do that you can just drop down there and you can just unlock the summoning pits and then you just follow this rockway all the way up top and you want to keep going up top there's actually an invisible wall hill type of thing that you keep walking over and then it drops you all the way down into the strike it's freaking weird guys it's crazy but i know for a fact when you're down there fogoth will not shoot you he'll just look at you all confused and that's just the coding of the game that's doing that to him but it's crazy all you have to do is you just kill him as you guys saw earlier in the video after you kill him you all jump off the map before the timer runs out and then it'll spawn you back into that room before Fogoth. It's weird. I don't know how, but make sure you pop a three of coins every single time for the exotics. You can open up those chests for unlimited loot and all that beautiful stuff. It's, I don't know, it's game breaking in my opinion. It's the best glitch so far in Destiny and there's going to be many more coming. So make sure you guys comment and subscribe and like this video so others can see. And I mean, it's PVE. It doesn't really affect the game in Crucible or anything. So just be happy, be positive, And please follow us on Twitter at RealTKOGaming because we're trying to be on the bungee bounty and we need your help. So please go there and retweet our tweet. I'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace.